The following is a paid program, and the views expressed on this show do not represent the views of WJZ-FM, Intercom Communications, its sponsors, or affiliates. The following is a pre-recorded show. Welcome to Winning in Retirement with your host, Brian Akers, certified financial planner professional and founder of Akers Financial Group. Now, helping you win in your retirement, here's Brian Akers. Hello, I'm Brian Akers from Akers Financial Group. I'm a certified financial planner, and we are the founder, I am the founder and actually the host of this radio show, Winning in Retirement. But today, I have a special for you, and that's from Akers Financial Group, uh, Alex Monk, certified financial planner, practitioner, um, accounting degree, a registered stockbroker, uh, investment advisor representative, has a life insurance agent license, and been with Acres almost Acres Financial almost 10 years. So good morning, Alex Monk. I feel like there should be fireworks with that intro. I think so, too. I didn't do your size and weight, but we're all right. We're in good shape. <laughs> um, so good morning, Alex. Um, we got a lot to do today. This show is really important. If you want to retire someday, you need to listen to this show. This show is called, Are You Ready to Retire? Many people would say, oh, yes, absolutely, I'm ready to retire. The problem is, is that's mentally, we need to talk about actual, financially, are you ready to retire? And that's what the show's about today. Alex, are you ready? Oh, yeah, Brian. This has been a a big topic. A lot of people are rethinking their jobs. And uh, if you don't have your plan in place, uh, that's a scary thing to do. So let's get into it. Yeah, so real simple is this. So today, if you want to know, are you ready to retire, you just give our office a call. What I mean by that is you call Acres Financial Group. You give us a call at 1-833-946-7384. That's 833-946-7384. Or go to our webpage at acresfinancialgroup.com. There you find more information about Acres Financial Group and about what we do for people. But we are offering today is an Are You Ready for Retirement review. What would you do when you meet with someone that comes in for that kind of review? So the, the first thing we do is we just start to talk, right? Like what makes them tick? What do you do for a living? Are you still working? Are you retired? Do you have any money? Do you have any debt? What are your concerns? Um, and just kind of see where it goes. Because, you know, Brian, every single meeting, I've had so many first meetings, and none of them are alike. They're always completely different, and you never know what to expect. Absolutely. But one thing at Acres Financial Group that you can expect is this, is we are going to start with your information, your unique financial fingerprint. We're going to begin with you rather than begin with what we want to sell, what we want to invest in, what we want to put your money in. That is a byproduct of advice when it comes to implementing a plan that's designed for you. So a unique financial fingerprint is really getting to know who you are. Just like a fingerprint or even a snowflake, you've seen a few of them. Um, The snowflakes are individual and different. Each and every person that comes into our offices, they're different in many different ways. And so what we try to do is sit down and find out where you are at the start. We use that with, we do that in a lot of different ways. So how do you begin to know someone's unique financial fingerprint, Alex? So usually they they show up and uh, they typically have information with them. Um, Things they've been collecting along the way or pension benefits or social security whatever it may be. Uh, And if they show up without any of that, I'm usually a little bit worried because it's like, um, have you looked into any of it yet? Where are you at with all that? (laughs) Um, Yeah, Yeah, so so basically uh, when someone calls for the first initial meeting, what happens is this, is that we'll send you an email with a lot of information. We'll send you disclosures about how we work. Uh, We have a lot of information there. And then we also uh, direct you to our website or through the email um, to basically uh, have some documents that you can then get you ready for that first meeting. So on our web page, there is a section called Documents, and you'll find our, our uh, Regulation Best Interest Disclosures, our Customer Relationship Summary. you also see a document ch- checklist of what to bring and a financial planning information form for you to fill out before that first meeting. Now, we're really not trying to scare you that you have to have it all done. The biggest deal is to have the first meeting is to come in. I think having that conversation, and then we can always gather more and more information as we need it, and we show you and prove to you why it's needed. Yeah, and it really is a, an important thing. And I've had seen so many people at that first meeting, they're a little apprehensive. Uh, you know, I don't know why. 
but it's probably their first time meeting with a, an advisor. Um, and then after the meeting, you can kind of see that they're relieved to at least start talking about it and, and facing the reality because today no one's going to take care of you in retirement. You got to take care of yourself. You got to make sure you have enough money to do that. Yeah, there's a saying, you don't know what you don't know. And sometimes you are so nervous about your retirement plan that you believe that if you ignore it, it'll get better. Or if you ignore it, you don't have to face it or have to make the changes that might be required to do better in your financial plan. What's neat about meeting a retirement advisor, a financial advisor that can actually sit down with where you are, we can actually see what's happened so far during your career. What have you been able to do with your work and through your savings? The reason we need to do this is that retirement is a big switch between relying on your ability to work it's going to be relying on what you saved, what hours you put in at certain companies, what pensions you created, how much time did you do. Retirement is a large change in life when it comes to relying on your ability to work versus the money you've set aside. What we like to do in financial planning is to start with right now. That financial fingerprint is to get an idea of where you are right now. So to find out if you're retirement ready is first of all to find out where you are and then we got to look at the future and figure out where you need to be. And you got to know how it all fits together. You can't just say, how do I invest with this one account? Because that one account could have impacts throughout your whole portfolio, um, and it may not make sense. So we need to see where you are today so we can point you in the right direction. Because if we don't know where you're at, how do we get you anywhere? <laughs> That's pretty bad. Uh, well, it's sort of like when you go for a trip, you got to get in the car. You, sort of, you should know where you're starting from, but hopefully your GPS knows. And so it's almost like um, you have a direction coach, your GPS, and people trust that a lot. So what we're talking about today is a retirement coach. Someone's going to um, guide you. The reason they're going to guide you is because that's what they do. Um, at Acres Financial Group, we have helped many, many people retire. Even throughout this, um, this last year is really helping them get ready to retire and to be able to stay retired. Retirement is much more than just walking in and quitting one day. It's about preparing, getting things in line, having your portfolio, portfolio built for the long run. Yeah, and it's a nice feeling to be able to say to a client when they call you, Brian, that you know you, they're okay to retire. If, if they don't want to go back into work, that's fine. But they're financially independent. We put in the work ahead of time so that they can do what they want with their life now because you work for 30 plus years and you, you save your hard-earned money, you want to make sure that it's there for you and your family. You don't want to give it all away to Uncle Sam, although I believe they always have their hands out. <clears throat> you want to make sure that it's there for you and it's going to do whatever you need it to do for the life you want. I mean, that's what retirement's about. Yeah, it's comments like, do you have your ducks in a row? Are all things lined up? Are you prepared? Are you waiting to retire? Or are you anticipating it? Or are you sort of uh, uh, dreading it because you're, you know you're not ready? And if you just don't know, what we recommend is that you look into calling us. Give us a call at 833-946-7384, and we'll sit down with you and talk about, are you ready to retire? Now, this review will involve that sit-down talk, and then we ask for information as we gather the numbers, and we do a basic number calculation to see where you are and where you stand. That review would be free and sit down with one of our team of advisors to talk about where you are right now, and then we go from there. Now, if you need a, a, a financial plan where we sit down and do a lot of financial planning, there's a fee involved with that. Um, if we invest money, things like that, there's fees, some, possibly a commission depending on what's going on. So that's how we try to work when it comes to actually implementing what's going on. But this Are You Retirement Ready is for radio listeners to think about, um, am I ready? Um, if not, let me get a good second opinion. And that's really what we would do, right, Alex? <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I, I don't know that I would trust the calculator on my, my workplace retirement thing. You know, I would want somebody that knows what's going on, just like my mechanic. I mean, he works on my car. <laughs> he knows the vehicle. I, I want to have someone that's accountable that can give me those kind of answers. And, and that's what our job is as financial planners, is to be that coach. Um, 
and sometimes it's it's life advice versus numbers because the numbers don't always line up with life but that's the most fun about it. it it's always different and to be able to see that look of relief or that look of fulfillment when you tell somebody hey you're financially independent you don't have to go back to work tomorrow it's awesome it is when it's a surprise for them so like uh Earlier this spring, I had a, a lady who was just talking about work and dreading going back in June, I think it was. And what we talked about was, um, what's your need? So knowing what your need is, that's what is your budget? What's the outflow? Do you have debt? And what is in the way of getting you ready to retire? Is there any large things that have to occur? And so what we do is we walk, we work through that. And when someone gets through all that, and then we look at the budget, we say, wow, you're in great shape to retire. We will put the numbers together, we'll explain and tell you that, and then guide people um, through that decision and ultimately to those retirement years where you get to choose and do what you want. And it's a big change. Um, you need to learn how to start withdrawing the money. I mean, you've spent so many years saving it, but now all, all of a sudden you have to flip the switch, and that's a big change. It's a whole paradigm shift. So knowing how the logistics and how you're going to access your money and having a plan on how your, your income is going to show up is so important. Right. So when people are ready to retire, what happens is they, they say things such as, absolutely, I can't wait. And then the question comes is this. So you're ready to retire. Are you really? And what we mean by that is, do you know that you're ready to retire? And that's what we try to do in that review. In retirement, the biggest worry of your day should be where to drink your morning cup of coffee where every day seems like a Saturday, free of stress. Your retirement income or investments are taken care of by the trustworthy team of advisors at Acres Financial Group. So what we're talking about today is are you retirement ready? And one way of being ready is to have an advisor that's there for you during your retirement years. You get to go do what you want to do during retirement, and then you let the retirement advice, retirement coaching, um, be up to your advisor, where you can call them, check in with them, say, well, this is my dreams next year, this is what I want to do. And as things change and change, uh, the advisor is there for you to guide you through each and every step, each and every law change, each and every decision that you need to make financially during the good years and possibly unhealthy years. Your future needs to be what you want it to be. It's not too late to begin planning. We want to provide you with that kind of retirement. Begin by calling Acres Financial Group to schedule your free meeting. Call us at 833-WIN-RETIRE. That's 833-W-I-N-R-E-T-I-R-E. When you call, you can leave us a voice message, and Susan will call you back on Monday to schedule an appointment with one of our team of advisors. That appointment could be a phone call, it could be a, um, a video call, or it could be mass-to-mass. We have a few of those. We thank you um, very much for understanding that during this time, it's hard to meet um, face-to-face um, with um, what's going on. So we recommend this. As you start planning now, call 833-946-7384 or visit acresfinancial.com. Do you have 10 times your salary saved for your retirement? Do you need 10 times? We will explain when we come back. You are unique. Just as no two fingerprints are alike, each individual's financial situation is uniquely their own. That's why the Acres Financial Group's team of advisors begins each relationship with a proven process that identifies your financial fingerprint. We'll guide you through a series of steps designed to provide a complete and accurate snapshot of where you are right now. Everything we learn about your financial fingerprint will become part of a detailed financial plan created especially for you. We'll never give you a cookie cutter proposal or suggest a one size fits all portfolio. The financial plan takes you from where you are now to where you need to be. Begin by discovering your financial fingerprint right now by going to GetMyFinancialFingerprint.com. That's GetMyFinancialFingerprint.com. Member FINRA SIPC. Are there times in some games you wish you could just turn on the TV at the two-minute warning? Because that's the most important part of the game, right? As a fan, these are the most exciting moments. Your team could take home the victory or crumble under pressure. But when it comes to your retirement, don't wait until the last two minutes. So much can happen in the final working years before retirement. 
Whether you're in your 50s or 60s, near or already in retirement, there's still time to put a plan in place. Don't wait until right before you retire to begin planning for your future. Can you win the retirement game like that? Come in and talk with the team at Acres Financial Group. They've been helping families in Maryland plan for retirement for over 30 years. Call to schedule your complimentary meeting at 833-WIN-RETIRE. The number again is 833-WIN-RETIRE. Start planning for your retirement now. Call 833-946-7384. Member FINRA SIPC. You're listening to a pre-recorded show. Welcome back to Winning in Retirement. Call 833-WIN-RETIRE now to schedule a visit with Brian and his team and begin winning in retirement. Once again, here's Brian Akers. Welcome back to Winning in Retirement. I'm Brian Akers. Here with me today is Alex Monk. We are certified financial planner practitioners from Akers Financial Group. Um, as we end the, ended the first quarter of our show, Winning in Retirement, I came up with this question for, for everyone, and that is this. Do you have 10 times your salary saved for your retirement? Do you need 10 times? Hey, Alex, what do you think of, of that question? Oh, that's a loaded question, Brian. I knew you were going to do this. This whole time I'm listening to those commercials, just waiting for you to do this to me. <laughs> Well, I gave you this question ahead of time so that you're very prepared, so that you can you can read your prepared remarks. So, it's not quite that simple. Uh, if that's a, a goal that people have, you know, that's a good target. You know, you need to set some type of goals, but everyone's situation is a lot different. So, the amount of money you need saved has to do with the amount of money you're going to need to spend and the amount of guaranteed income sources that you have. You maybe maybe have a pension or social security security or some combination of the both. So, you know, there's situations where some people never work. They just are born with money or without. Um, so it's different for everybody and it really depends on how much do you need every month? And what are your what are your outflows like? And how long do you think you're going to live? And that's a question that I don't know that anyone's given me a good answer. <laughs> um, say that part again, that question. No one uh, is able to tell me how long they're going to live. Okay. <laughs> well, uh, my comment normally comes around like this. We need to plan our estate and wills as if we might die tomorrow. But then we got to build an investment and income plan that's going to last a lifetime. That lifetime means that we can't run out of money no matter what that answer is. So the fact that no one knows I think is a very wise thing and the fact that we can actually plan that you're going to live up into those 90s and beyond and that you will have income requirements. Some people may be retired longer than they worked with modern health care and everything else right now. That's an amazing thing for people to think about. Did they save enough to do it? So this concept of 10 times your salary, let's just do a quick little math. And that is if you make 100000 a year, 10 times would be about a million dollars, right? It's 10, carry the one. Yeah, you got yeah, it. Yeah, all right, all right. That's pretty good. So a million dollars. Now, in portfolio design, if you use a 4% rule, that only provides 40000 a year. That doesn't replace 100000 a year. So and that 40000 you might have to pay tax too, Brian. Hey, come on. Don't be so rude with, with this. I mean, I'm just trying to give an example. You don't have to squish it. I mean, you're, it's tax, 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 right? Got to watch out for that guy with his hand out, you know? I don't I don't want to give too much to him. Yes, they do tax in retirement years. Um, not every state does, but um, federal government does, especially if we, if we are withdrawing from a pre-tax retirement plan or we're taking out employer contributions, things like that. And that's why as early as possible, you need to do many things to make that money tax-free in your retirement years so that you're not sharing with anybody else when you need it most. But let's go back to this 10 times um, concept. So you have a $100,000 salary and you need 10 times as just a guideline. Now, there's some people's guidelines. They'll say seven times up to 14 times your salary just as a range. So I don't believe there is a, a quick, oh, yeah, I'm good. You just can't look at it real fast and say, oh, yeah, you're fine for retirement. It's a lot more involved than that. And that's the point we're trying to make here. Ten times your salary is a very good number to look at trying to have money saved. But many times that's not enough depending on what you're doing. 
if people are making 80000 or 100000 a year, what generally what happens is you take out Social Security tax, which is 7.65, you take out what you're saving for the future, you might only need 80000 to retire on. And then when you look at retirement, you got to look at what's going to come in. Are you going to get Social Security? How much should you rely on Social Security for your retirement years? What are your investments? What are your needs? So what we do at Acres Financial Group, we believe that the best combination is to have lower bills. The lower your bills, the easier it is to retire. So what I mean by that is if we don't owe any money, our bills are very low. And that is a great way to start when it comes down to, can I retire? Hey, what are your bills? That's more money to spend on uh, fun stuff, not stuff just to to maintain your life. You know, you you don't want to retire and then get stuck in the house on a $20 a month fun budget. Yeah. Well, um, for those who don't know, I'm in my early 50s, and I think 53. Three still early. Um, at least for me, it feels early. <laughs> but, um, no. but generally, I'm entering that phase of where uh, when you're young and you just get married, it's called dink, double income, um, no kids. And then there's a phase when those kids are moving out of the house and life starts to change. But the, cre- the best thing is your money becomes your own for the first time in maybe 20, 25 years, depending on how many kids you had. And all of a sudden, you got to say, what should I do with this money? What kind of balance can I have between now and later? We believe in having balance. Now, some people say, oh, I want to retire. That's my only goal. And so they're going to work extra and then try to hit their number by 60, 62, 67, 70, whatever that number year might be. So what we try to do in financial planning is this. Are you retirement ready is an analysis that we will do for you. Just to give you a second opinion of but what does it look like? Are you retirement ready or do you have some work to do? And then what we do is we come alongside and help guide you um, through that process. Financial planning is the answer to ant- to giving you, are you retirement ready? Now, generally, if you're looking at where you stand in your income and cash flow, you need to gather information and, and understand where you are at the start. And then we build this financial plan and this retirement plan to help you retire and stay retired. Yeah, you don't want to have to go and uh, get a, another job later in life. It doesn't sound like any fun. And the funny thing about retirement planning, Brian, is there's always a number at which someone can retire. You know, they can spend X number of dollars. But the question is usually, is that enough or is that what you want it to look like? Because some people show up and they have no clue how much money they're spending. So then it's like, okay, how how do we how do we even equate how retirement's going to look for you? Like we got to figure out where the money's going and is it going in the right places? And do we have enough saved to support that or is it time to, you know, rein some things in and and make some lifestyle decisions? It's just it's about what you want it to look like for you and your family. Yeah, it's um it's really strange when people come in because everyone's so different and they have a different mindset on money, a different mindset on what's going on in life. And some people um, are great savers. They've always saved. And it's really hard to be able to say to them that uh, you're not on track to retire. It's just a matter of choices. And then there's pretty much what I call normal America, which is not savers. Um, uh, if you have to look at Americans and look at with the way we're marketed to and presented to on TV and everywhere. It's all about the now. It's all about spending money and having fun and pleasure. All these things are about the now, which drives up credit card debt and other things that then ultimately drains your future away so you can't retire. So when you're thinking about retirement, you have to understand that you got to be doing something about retirement. So what I just said is this. When you think about it, do something about it. Any little thing is the best is the best thing to start with. The best example are people who have a, a, a job that matches your 401k and they are not getting the full match. Yes, we have met with people and we, the very first thing we recommend is maximize your match. And this could be people making three, four hundred thousand dollars a year 
that never really looked at it. They just were running in their life as fast as possible, and they were missing out on free money to help them for retirement. So these are just some of the mistakes that we've seen. Yeah, and, and that one is surprisingly common, and uh, employers build that into your compensation. You've got to maximize everything that you have available, and, and that's what we're for. You know, This is what we do. We've seen countless summary plan documents and benefit packages. We can explain what all that jargon means because it's not simple. Yeah, so the process we do is when, when our clients are getting ready to retire, they come in for a pre-retirement talk and they bring in their paperwork. We help them fill it out. We don't want to check the wrong box. Um, and then as we've turned that all in, we look at if you have pensions, which is an amazing thing to have, we look at how to choose. We try to talk about how important the joint survivor benefit is and don't just take the single life. Taking the joint survivor is best for a couple to make that money last a lifetime. And then we talk about many other things when it comes to retirement choices as they get ready. Health care is huge, especially for anybody retiring before 65. All, all of this comes into place when we're trying to build this retirement plan to last a lifetime. And those early retirees, Brian, are they the ones that uh, you really have to watch because taking out more in those early years for health insurance or before other income starts can really add up and having big, big withdrawal years early in retirement can really reduce the longevity of your money if you don't have it planned out right. Absolutely. So when it comes to um, do you need 10 times your salary to retire, I think that's a good start. You need a financial plan to know if you can retire. That's the answer. Rather than a guideline, do the work, do the planning. And that planning begins now. No matter what age you are, begin with a financial plan to know that you're doing the right things to make this work. Are we talking the, the starting salary or the final salary? <laughs> uh, we try to use the, the later years pre-retirement within the last eight years, five to eight years salary that you're truly living off of at that time. Yeah. Now, what happens in life is this. We've had a, a tough year, but that year has caused some people to be very defensive. Uh, defensive is a reaction to how things are going on. An example might be sitting on your sofa. You keep moving back and back and back, reacting. Reacting has the energy of being defensive. Creating, now you sit up, you sit forward, you move forward. You have an energy of creating. People who will get through all this and be prepared to retire, to be in the best shape, are the ones that take this opportunity and this time in their life to make sure things are good. Are you retirement ready? Are you ready for that solution? Let's be in the creating mode. Give us a call and let's begin working on the decision. Are you retirement ready? So give us a call at Acres Financial Group to schedule that free meeting at 833-WIN-RETIRE. That's 833-W-I-N-R-E-T-I-R-E. When you call, you leave us a voice message, and Susan will call you back on Monday to schedule an appointment with one of our team of advisors. Start planning now for your retirement. Call 833-946-7384 or go to acresfinancial.com. You want a secure retirement. But what is that? You must manage risk into and through your retirement. This is really important. We will talk about this in a moment. Imagine you're retired. You wake up in the morning and you don't even know what day it is. Every day seems like a Saturday. You can sleep in, cook a nice full breakfast without thinking about morning traffic or work deadlines. The Saturday calmness you used to crave is now your everyday feeling. You're not worried about your retirement income or how your investments are doing. Your biggest decision that day is where you're going to drink that first cup of coffee. Is that the kind of retirement you want? If it is, then sit down and talk with the team at Acres Financial Group. They want to help you get there. They've been helping families in Maryland plan for retirement for over 30 years. Call to schedule your complimentary meeting at 833-WIN-RETIRE. The number again is 833-WIN-RETIRE. Start planning for your retirement now. Call 833-946-7384. Member FINRA SIPC. Acres Financial Group was founded on the principles of integrity, trust, and service. We believe each and every client is unique and deserves advice and implementations that apply directly towards their personal financial fingerprint. 
This financial fingerprint tells us the objective risk tolerance and purpose of the investment and insurance tools that we use to assist our clients in reaching their goals by discovering the purpose of each financial decision. We can help you accomplish your goals. Intelligent financial design starts with a detailed balance sheet and cash flow to know where to start. This leads to a financial decision that will allow you to reach your goals with your risk tolerance in mind. Our relationships begin with an initial consultation and grows with each meeting. We would be thrilled to work with you and begin your planning process. Call us at 833-WIN-RETIRE. That's 833-946-7384. Or visit our website at acresfinancial.com. Member FINRA SIPC. You're listening to a pre-recorded show. Welcome back to Winning in Retirement. Call 833-WIN-RETIRE now to schedule a visit with Brian and his team and begin winning in retirement. Once again, here's Brian Akers. Welcome back to Winning in Retirement. At Akers Financial Group, we want you to be winning in retirement. I'm Brian Akers and the president of Akers Financial Group, and we thank you for listening to our radio show. And we're moving on to our second half of this show. The second half of the show, we still have Alex Monk. Alex Monk's coming out of the locker room, warmed up. He's uh, got, got some water in him or, or, or some type of drink, soda drink, and um, we're getting ready to go. Are you ready, Alex? It's not quite as good as Lamar coming back at the end of the fourth quarter the other night to save the day, but it's pretty good, Brian. I'm showing up <laughs> strong today. Yeah, that, that was pretty legit. That was awesome. All right, so this section, the third quarter, is this. You want a secure retirement, but what is that? You must manage risks into and through your retirement years. So, Alex, uh, what is a secure retirement? That's, uh, it's knowing your numbers and knowing where where your next meal is going to come from. Um, and that's that's your, your monthly income or whether you, you take it all out in the first, you know, the first month of the year, however you do it. But knowing that you cannot outlive some or all or a portion of your money is a very big deal, especially with, like we talked about earlier, longevity. We have so many clients that are in their 90s now, Brian, and that's that's a that's a long retirement. And I don't know if, if, if you've noticed, but it seems like things are starting to cost more here in the, in the recent six to 10 months. So you got to make sure that your money's able to grow and support whatever you need to spend every month to live and to enjoy your life. Knowing that that's taken care of, that would, is what I would call a secure retirement. What do you think? Yeah, secure retirement, There's let's divide that into two pieces. One is the reality of your investment portfolio having a protected or secure piece. And then the other concept would be is do you feel secure in your retirement? So we got emotional and then actual numbers, two different pieces. So on the financial planner side, we want to make sure your numbers work and we want to make sure the portfolio is designed to take the least amount of risk to reach your goals rather than the most amount of risk to reach your goals. That is a hard one for many people. Some people that have been a stock investor and they have all their portfolio in stocks heading into retirement, they're um, pretty amazed by how we need to slow it down and start to pull money out of the market as we get closer to your retirement years. So as you hit your mid-50s, that break, start, got to start tapping the brake, put some money into a protected side, money that will not lose when things go down or if there's something that we can't control, changes life as, as we know it. What we need to do is have secure things that provide our income and secure investments that won't lose the principle that we work so hard for. Yeah, and that can start, you know, 50s, you know, whenever you start to think about what you want your future to look like. And then you can really start structuring different types of um investments or insurance products that will pay you out and and you can ladder them so that you have a bunch of different income sources coming in triggering at different times that way you're going to be able to keep up with inflation you don't have to worry about market risk on a portion of your money and that base income hopefully all of it you know could be satisfied and what that does is it allows you to take a lot more risk with your other funds or you know, whatever risk you want to take with them. And that's really the key is to, to set up 
where you're going to get your money from. I, you say this all the time, Brian, but retirement is a game of cash flows. If you got all this money over in XYZ account, that's fine and good. But when it comes to every month, you got to pay your bills. So I hope that is flowing into the checking account because there's no other way around it. <laughs> yeah. I was trying to think about just um, the clients that we've met with recently. Uh, I had this one client that I was looking to retire in March, um, but the, the life that they want to lead is what I call the RV life. And so we're lining everything up for that RV life. Um, RV life, for those who aren't um, RVers, it's about buying the big equipment that you're going to travel the country with when you retire. This comes in many different versions, from sleeping in the back of a pickup truck, tent camping, um, to pull behind the fifth wheels, to Class A vehicles, to incredible um, RVs, depending on what people like to do. But it's a lifestyle that requires cash flow and a large down payment to be able to buy and purchase what they want. So that's all part of financial planning as you get ready to make those to make that your retirement. So in the case I'm thinking I'm thinking about right now that I'm working on, this client for about the last few years, we've truly just been getting ready for it. You know, um, getting their cash flow in line, making them focus on every month all the money coming in while they're working, how they can get rid of debt so that their cash flow is as little as possible. So they can afford the gas in the RV when they retire. What's um, it cost to fill one of them things up? Uh, oh, my. Uh, yes, I did have an RV. I had a, a Class A, which was really nice for about five years. And it's wonderful. It, it's all about how far you drive each day and how much you're <laughs> on the move. Uh, let's just say 90 gallons is not hard to fill up <laughs> when you need just to go a, a, a few Eight or nine hundred miles, <laughs> so oh, it is about money. It's like having a boat. Um, people have boats, need money for fuel for that. So uh, many of, of the guys we get um, uh, basically accused of our toys cost a lot of money, and so in the retirement years we got to have our base money to live off of, and then we almost need to have separate money for the play accounts. And we need to have as much money set aside to provide for play as we do for the reality of um, eating and, and surviving <laughs> in health care, things like that. It's, uh, it's incredible how many used sports cars you'll start to see when you're retired and having lunch out every day. <laughs> used, yeah. Well, I guess people have that midlife crisis car. Um, there's all kinds of phases of life, and you think about what people do with their money, and what I want you to do is this. you got to have your financial plan. And that financial plan, you got to take um, today's wants and desires and also think about tomorrow's needs. Tomorrow's needs are very important. And we need to throw money into your future because no one else is doing that anymore. The Social Security that we have will be different in 10 years from now. There are... Um, from the Government Accounting Office, they put out numbers saying that by the mid-2030s uh, that Social Security will have to be reduced to roughly 77% of what they're paying now. I believe that that's going to affect people that are saving and getting ready to retire more than it will affect those already retired. But that's my, my basic way of thinking of it at the moment. So Social Security might be a big chunk of, of your retirement plan for lower-income people. As you move up the scale of income, Social Security truly um, stops. So around 20000 a year, Social Security is there for you. And the twenty-five to thirty, it, like, it can provide some of that income. Like a year, I'm talking about. When you get into that need 80000 a year, need one twenty a year, need 200000 a year, that is all about what you've saved and built your growth on. Social Security is just a small piece. Pensions have constantly been changing. And disappearing. I also think health care is going to be a massive number that we need to make sure we plan for it. One of the biggest government debts that's not on the books yet is the future cost of Medicare and Medicaid. And that is in the trillions of dollars. That's going to affect taxes to our future and also affect the cost of Medicare and premiums. Not trying to depress you. I just want you to know that when you're thinking about today's wants, think about tomorrow's needs. Make sure you put money into your future for tomorrow. You've got to do that. And it's, you got to remember that it's, it's everyone out there. It's your individual plan. So if you don't like what your current people are telling you, you need to get a second opinion. You only really get one shot at retirement, or hopefully one shot. 
Um, you don't want to do it too many times. But it, it's worth getting a second opinion so that you feel comfortable. It's a very big deal, and, and you need to understand what's going on and, and how it all works because no one's going to care about your money the way that you do. And that's why you need a coach to help you win that game. You have to take it seriously. You need to look at where you are. We call that the unique financial fingerprint. You need to put together your documents and where you are and where where's money going. And then you build a financial plan around that. That involves everything. Estate planning, insurance planning, investment strategy and review. How, how and what you buy with your investments. What risks do you take? Um, what are you doing at work? What are you doing separately? Are you doing Roth IRAs? You need to have a lot of things in place to make this all work well for your retirement years. And we highly recommend you get started when it, when it comes to building this retirement plan for you. And Brian, you mentioned something. How much risk are people taking? I would venture to bet 60, 70% of the people out there have no clue how much risk they're taking. Yeah. Uh, well, risk, I guess even like in 2020, the risk of the COVID um, pandemic we saw the market drop very quickly for roughly two months. And then it had a quick V-shaped recovery uh, when it came to the market. But it wasn't all stocks, but it was the index itself. So that is just an example of, oh, it'll come back quickly. Now, long-term money, it says it's okay to come back. If you think about 08, 09's downturn, it took seven years for the market to get back and stay up from where it had went before it went down in 07. So 07 was a peak, 08 or 09 went down, then it started to rise. It took another seven years to recover during that, during that time. Yep, but you got to have time. Right, so when we're talking about secure retirement, part of it is the numbers. The other part is, are you secure with the plan? Secure with that plan is to know that you're okay. How do you know you're okay if you don't have someone check that out and tell you you're okay and go through it with you? So knowing what's going on, extremely, extremely important. We want retirement to be great for you. The best part of retirement should be getting your time back. You decide how to use it. Before retirement, your time is tied up with other commitments, mainly your job. A lot of that goes away. Your time is now consumed by things you want to do. To begin winning in retirement, call us at 833-WIN-RETIRE. That's 833-W-I-N-R-E-T-I-R-E. When you call, you leave a voice message, and Susan will call you back on Monday to schedule an appointment with one of our team of advisors. This appointment will be um, over the phone, through a virtual Zoom-type meeting, or possibly in mass-to-mass. Start planning for retirement now. Call 833-946-7384, visit acresfinancialgroup.com, or check us out on Facebook. Do you have a retirement coach? You only do this once, so do it right. We'll explain how when we come back. Hi, this is Jesse Cunningham, the owner of Mountain View Insurance, and we are proud to be affiliated with Acres Financial Group. We, too, base our business on integrity, service, and acknowledge that every client's insurance needs are unique to their own situation. At Mountain View Insurance, we specialize in car insurance, home insurance, and umbrella coverages, all designed to protect your assets that you've worked so hard to earn. When serving our clients, we focus on creating a protection plan that is appropriate to your needs. After we determine the correct plan, we then go to shop for you. Mountain View Insurance is an independent insurance brokerage, and that means we have access to many top national and regional insurance carriers. Let us build an appropriate and affordable insurance plan for you and give us a call directly at 410-262-3176. Once again, that's 410-262-3176. This is Jesse Cunningham, owner of Mountain View Insurance, and I look forward to hearing from you. Are you reacting or creating with your investments? When you have a sound financial plan, you don't have to be reacting every day. Let us help you create. Tune in to Winning in Retirement, Saturdays at 11 a.m. on 105.7 The Fan. Brian Akers of Akers Financial Group is a registered representative offering securities through Kalos Capital Incorporated, member of FINRA SIPC, and investment advisory services offered through Kalos Management Incorporated, both located at 11525 Parkwood Circle, Alpharetta, Georgia, 30005 678 Acres Financial Group is not an affiliate or subsidiary of Kalos Capital or Kalos Management and does not provide tax and legal services. Are you reacting or creating with your investments? When you have a sound financial plan, you don't have to be reacting every day. Let us help you create. Tune in to Winning in Retirement, Saturdays at 11 a.m. on 
Kevin the Fan. Brian Akers of Akers Financial Group is a registered representative offering securities through Kalos Capital Incorporated, member of FINRA SIPC, and investment advisory services offered through Kalos Management Incorporated, both located at 11525 Parkwood Circle, Alpharetta, Georgia, 30005 1100 Akers Financial Group is not an affiliate or subsidiary of Kalos Capital or Kalos Management and does not provide tax and legal services. You're listening to a pre-recorded show. Welcome back to Winning in Retirement. Call 833-WIN-RETIRE now to schedule a visit with Brian and his team and begin winning in retirement. Once again, here's Brian Akers. Yes, welcome back to Winning in Retirement. Welcome to the fourth quarter. Yes, we're here in the fourth quarter of our show that we, we run each and every week. I'm Brian Akers, president of Akers Financial Group and host of Winning in Retirement. Here with me today is Alex Monk. We're both experienced certified financial planners. And today we've been talking about, are you retirement ready? If you'd like to find out more about that, give us a call at 8th. 833-946-7384 and schedule a time to talk with one of our advisors about are you retirement ready. During this show in the first quarter, we talked about unique financial fingerprint and where you are to start. In the second quarter, we talked about is 10 times your salary enough? And we found that 10 times salary is not enough for a full financial plan. You need that full financial plan. In the third quarter, we're talking about what a secure retirement feels like, looks like, and how we basically try to do it. Here in the fourth quarter is about the following. That is this. Do you have a retirement coach? You do this only once, so make sure you do it right. So if you'd like to hear this show again, you can go to our website at acresfinancialgroup.com and you can hear this show. It'll be on the website by um, Tuesday, Wednesday of next week, and you can hear this show again. But most importantly, give us a call at 833-946-7384 for Are You Retirement Ready review, and that can give you a good second opinion of where you are. All right, so Alex Monk, when we talk about do people have a retirement coach, you only do this once, so do it right. What are we, what are we trying to get across here? You, you got to get it together. You got to know where your ducks are, as we said earlier uh, in the show. And you need somebody that looks out for your best interest, right? And that's my favorite thing about doing what we do is at the end of the day, I can always look myself in the mirror and say, I did what was best for my clients today. And that's what you get when you you call us, right? I mean, that's what we do. Yeah, we get we get accused of being too conservative on on our answers, and the reason is is because we want to make sure this this retirement lasts a lifetime. We don't want to have unusual risk into that answer of "Are you okay?" We want you to be retired and stay retired. We don't want anything to come in and change that. Um, throughout my career, yes, I've started back in 1987. I'm still able to walk, which is good. But um, what happens is this, is that things change constantly. Um, throughout the 80s, it was pretty good for the stock market. Um, but there's been many years of downturns from the 87 crash to um, just 1990s. There's some currency problems, Mexican peso, Argentina, a bunch of problems. And then we have 2000s. We had all um, the negative decade was 2000 to 2010 a very tough time period for the markets. And so a conservative approach helped people make their money last during those years. 2010 to 2020 has been more of a bull market, if you think about it, um, and where the indexes, the technology stocks have really taken off. What does the next 10 years have for us? Um, and what's going to happen there? A retirement coach will guide you through this, no matter what happens, to make sure you're okay. And no, ma- no matter how many times we say it um, or we think about it and we say, look, if you're going to be retired for 30 years, there's a good chance that the market will have a correction or you know, a bear market two times. So statistically, we know these things are going to happen, but when they're happening, we don't always act right. And, and that's what having a coach is for. So when these abnormal scenarios come along, we can stay cool-headed and actually use whatever the situation is to the best of our advantage. And, and I think this year is a, a very strange year, but a testament to how being in a creation mode and not a, a retreat mode has really benefited our clients and, and you know their overall well-being and retirement. And for me, it's been nice to be there for people. It kept me a little sane, too. <laughs> yeah, 
I'm sorry. I'm not going to make a comment on keeping you sane, but I'm going to make a comment on just being there for people. Um, I really like the old school concept of you call and someone answers the phone. And so we built the service side of Acre Snatch Group around that. We have a great group of employees that help service what our clients need, from the um, reception area that um, answers the call to operations that answers the need to financial advisors and their para planners to, uh, to assist and guide in the decision making. This is a lot that we bring to the table. Our staff of Acres Financial Group is 19 people that work at Acres Financial Group. We are designed to work with clients, and right now we have clients in over 20-some different states and some clients all around the world based on where their work has taken them. Acres Financial Group and being a retirement coach is what we do. Retirement coach doesn't just start on retirement day. It's about pre-practice. It's getting you ready, getting you warmed up. It's sort of like um, you, if you're talking about basketball coaching, you get someone in junior high and you're trying to teach them how to do a right and left-hand layup. Um, you, you see a tall kid in the hall and you say, hey, I think this might be good for you. And so you try to teach them the basic skills. And by their senior year, you're looking at college offers and all kinds of stuff like that. Uh, so that's what I, I, I lay in. I basically, when I think about it, I'm, I'm thinking about what retirement looks like to me. And retirement is just really coaching people to be ready for that retirement day. We want to be financially independent, and that's where we're choosing to work. What, and by choosing to work means that we know we're okay, we could retire any day, but financial independence says I'm working because I want to, and then you retire on your own terms. The the funniest part about what you just said, Brian, is that you actually are a basketball coach as well and probably do track down tall people and just say, hey, <laughs> <laughs> well, Come to the gym. <laughs> well, the trick is to look in the middle school wing for anybody with their head above the locker uh, or their feet size 11 or, tall or longer. <laughs> no, I, it, it's wonderful when you, you can spot a kid early and help, the, help them develop to be what they, what they need to be. Um, but in, in basketball coaching, uh, what's great is you take um, kids where they are and you try to develop them as a team and individually. A lot like that when it comes to retirement planning. No matter what the client is when they come in, they've got to start where they are. That's that unique financial fingerprint. And then we really have to listen to what's in your goals. This is a different approach than what you hear out there. Many people are talking gimmicks and sales concepts and products all the time. And the fact that their solution is product-driven, a product that might be one product that they sell, and they might not sell anything more than just one product. Solution-driven advice starts with you. There's a big difference when it comes to how you make this work for you. Simple retirement planning is to know your numbers and then work through it each and every year. We do not disappear from our clients. We are there in meetings over the phone, um, the Zoom meetings. We're doing many, many of them. But when it comes to being a retirement coach, Acres Financial Group, we take it seriously. And I know this show's been very serious, but we, you know we we do have a good time. I enjoy myself every day. I feel like, and it, it's fun to watch people progress. And you know, you get to know people, and it's it's a it's a good relationship. And you, you know, you get to spend some of your life together, and that's that's fun for me. Yeah, back when I first started my first company in the very early '90s, uh, one of my clients, I think they're 46 years old. And, of course, there's still clients now, and uh, they're in their mid-70s, and they come in and go, I remember that young kid came to our house. And they remember the first advice that I gave them. And I said that um, they had money in savings, and I said, well, why don't we pay off the mortgage, and so then you'll have extra cash flow that we can save and invest over time. And I was the first advisor to give them that simple advice that, that they had interviewed, and so they hired me, even though I think I was 23 at the time. They hired me then, and um, they've been a client for 30-plus years. So it's been pretty impressive um, to, to have a client like that, that you can guide them all the way through their careers and then all the way into retirement. They've been retired for at least um, 12, 13 years now. And uh, most people they probably met with before you were trying to sell them whatever they had, whatever their thing yeah. was. And and that's not the way it works, right? You don't have a cookie and then go look for the cutter. It's the other way around. Um, so it's always got to be about the client. I don't understand how people are even able to invest money if they don't know 
how it fits in for the rest of their stuff. I don't get it. But re- but planning scares people, and so when they think about re- financial planning, they're like, oh, I, I can't do that. So what we recommend is let someone else do it. Get That's a retirement us. coach. Let them do all the work. You provide the numbers. They give you a guideline. You come in for a checklist, and they say, here, do this homework. We'll do this for you. We'll help. We'll hold your hand. We'll help you walk you through. Are we allowed to hold hands right now? Probably not. Metaphorically, no. holding hand yeah. through the Zoom, right? Yes. It's like an on-the-glass thing. Yeah, so it's a concept more than reality. <laughs> but, but when retirement planning is helping you make the tough decisions and knowing that they're going to be the right ones long-term for you and your family so that we can handle the good days and the bad days. Retirement is not just perfect. Things change. We have to adapt and change with them. Yeah, and, and the financial plan is a, it's just like your life. It's going to change. It's going to go in different directions. You just have to keep checking in on it and make sure what you're doing matches up with the results you're hoping to get. Right, so we provide our, our clients a website where they can go to and see their investments all in one place. That's provided to our clients of Acres Financial Group. We have annual reviews that, depending on the need, could be one annual review a year or multiple, depending on what's going on in a client's life. And then the ability to call the office and talk to someone, um, a person, whenever they need something done or some help or whatever is going on. So there's many things going on in your life. We need to know, are you retirement ready? You need to know, are you retirement ready? Do you have what it takes to retire? Have you done the work? Begin doing the work by calling Acres Financial Group. Acres Financial Group is built around financial advice that leads to a good and solid retirement plan to help you be retired and make that money last a lifetime. Retirement um, is just something that really is... uh, How do I put it nicely? It's a dream people have, and people want to fulfill that dream by working hard. So Acres Financial Group, we're local, we're independent. We don't report to a big company on Wall Street. We do have offices in Lutherville and Forest Hill. Nowadays, we're meeting more on Zoom and phone calls, but we do have offices where employees work out of, and we have a lot of people stopping by to drop things off in our um, COVID clean offices there. Um, to begin winning in retirement, you should give us a call at Acres Financial Group to schedule a free meeting. Call us at 833-WIN-RETIRE. That's 833-W-I-N-R-E-T-I-R-E. When you call, leave us a voice message, and Susan will call you back on Monday to schedule a phone appointment. Um, start planning now. Call us 833-946-7384 or visit acresfinancialgroup.com. Thank you for listening. I'm Brian Akers from Akers Financial, and we want you to be winning in retirement. You've been listening to Winning in Retirement with your host, Brian Akers of Akers Financial Group. Brian Akers of Akers Financial Group is a registered representative offering securities through Kalos Capital Incorporated and investment advisory services through Kalos Management Incorporated. Akers Financial Group is not an affiliate or subsidiary of Kalos Capital or Kalos Management and does not provide tax and legal services. Advice given on winning in retirement is general in nature, and one should seek further advice from their financial financial advisor, broker, attorney, or tax accountant before investing. Be sure to read each prospectus carefully to understand all the risks associated with each investment. Are you reacting or creating with your investments? When you have a sound financial plan, you don't have to be reacting every day. Let us help you create. Tune in to Winning in Retirement, Saturdays at 11 a.m. on 105.7 The Fan. Brian Akers of Akers Financial Group is a registered representative offering securities through Kalos Capital Incorporated, member of Finresipic, and investment advisory services offered through Kalos Management Incorporated, both located at 11525 Parkwood Circle, Alpharetta, Georgia, 30005 678 Akers Financial Group is not an affiliate or subsidiary of Kalos Capital or Kalos Management and does not provide tax and legal services. Are you reacting or creating with your investments? When you have a sound financial plan, you don't have to be reacting every day. Let us help you create. Tune in to Winning in Retirement, Saturdays at 11 a.m. on 105.7 The Fan. Brian Akers of Akers Financial Group is a registered representative offering securities through Kalos Capital Incorporated, member of Finresipic, and investment advisory services offered through Kalos Management Incorporated, both located at 11525 Parkwood Circle, Alpharetta, Georgia, 30005 678 Acres Financial Group is not an affiliate or subsidiary of Kalos Capital or Kalos Management and does not provide 
tax and legal services. Are you reacting or creating with your investments? When you have a sound financial plan, you don't have to be reacting every day. Let us help you create. Tune in to Winning in Retirement Saturdays at 11 a.m. on 1057 The Fan. Brian Akers of Akers Financial Group is a registered representative offering securities through Kalos Capital Incorporated, member FINRA SIPC, and investment advisory services offered through Kalos Management Incorporated, both located at 11525 Parkwood Circle, Alpharetta, Georgia, 30005 678 Akers Financial Group is not an affiliate or subsidiary of Kalos Capital or Kalos Management and does not provide tax and legal services. The preceding was a paid program, and the views expressed on this show do not represent the views of WJZFM, Intercom Communications, its sponsors, or affiliates. Streaming from Baltimore across the world. Across the world. This is a radio.com station. Broadcasting from the Thompson Creek Window Company Studios. High quality windows at an affordable price. Direct from their local factory. This is WJZFM Catonsville, Baltimore. 1057 a fan. A radio.com sports station.